Hi, I'm Jim Brickle, and this is Getting to Know Your 2017 Ford Edge SEL. We'll start at the back end. The release for getting in. Opens up for your spare tire and extra storage compartments below. And on the left hand side, there's a couple of buttons to fold the chairs down. Coming around on the driver's side of the vehicle is your fuel door. It is our easy fuel system and no gas cap is required. Inside the vehicle, you can quite easily fold the chairs back up. And you can see you do have the air conditioning vents in the back. You've got storage pockets. And on the driver door, there is a keyless entry pad. As we get in the vehicle, your left hand has your mirror controls, so pick which mirror you want to choose. Use the arrows to move it in the direction you need. Your power windows, and then your power door locks. Coming around, you do have the lights, and if you turn them all the way to this position, that's in the automatic settings. To start the vehicle, put your foot on the brake and hit this button to the right of the steering column. Now, on the steering wheel, on the left hand side we have five way arrows. And as you hit the arrows, it gives you choices. So you've got your display mode. You can have just the um, tachometer showing. You can show the engine temperature. You can show your tire pressure. You can show your, disc, your speedometer digitally. And when you hit the OK, it'll shift from miles per hour to kilometers per hour. So quite handy if you're crossing the border from Canada to the United States. As we go down, another handy one is distance to empty. So on a full tank of gas, this vehicle is saying it can go 720 kilometers. On the right hand side of the steering wheel, there's another five way. And that's going to control what's showing on the right hand side. So you can have your entertainment, your navigation, and your phone features. Entertainment, if the radio was on or a CD was playing, it would display up there. Navigation, if you don't have a destination programmed in, it'll just show a compass and then phone would show who you're connected to. On the left hand side of the steering wheel going down you've got your cruise control so it's on and off and then once you've got it you can increase your speed or decrease by one mile per hour simply by tapping the plus or the minus. Resume and cancel. If you hit your brakes while cruise control is on It'll uh, remember your speed, but uh, this can help you to slow down. And then when you hit resume, it'll take you back up to your preset speed. On the right-hand side, going below the five-way, you can answer a telephone call. You can hang up on a telephone call. And when you're not on a call, these can be used for switching to the next uh, save station on your stereo volume up and down and uh, muting the stereo. This one here that looks like a little talking head is your voice activation. Please say a command. Find an address. In Ontario, please say the street address, including the city. To search in another state, say change state. 375 Ontario Street, St. Catharines. When ready, press the voice button and then say, set as destination, or say, change something. 
Set as destination. Setting destination. Obey traffic laws, be alert, and use voice commands while driving. Please proceed to the highlighted route, and then the route guidance will start. So in this case, it shows I'm 60 meters away, and it's 2.07 now, and by 2.07, I should be at my destination. So it shows on here with the red S start uh, flag and a checkered flag as your finished location. If you decide you didn't want to go there after all. Please say a command. Cancel route. Are you sure you want to cancel your route? Yes. Canceling route. Now also on your touch screen, when it says controls, you can bring up your audio controls. And right now it's playing 107.9. If you wanted that as one of your favorites, you can push down here. Sound will go off and when you hear the beep, it's now locked in. Up here it says sources. You've got AM, FM, Sirius Satellite Radio. You can get a uh, free preview on. Right now, you can listen to our most popular SiriusXM package with introductory plans on new subscriptions as low as $5 a month. Plus, we possibly have, particularly a singer. We were yeah. told the story directly by Australian singer Samantha If you wanted Sonic. to lock that in, ago, push it. Same thing. Your other choices are your climate controls. She noticed her girlfriend at the and up here is your heated steering wheel. Actually, Samantha said, arrows for where temperature you want going. Buzzing around me. And when it comes to phone, you would hit add a phone. And on your phone, you would go to your settings, Bluetooth, discoverable, and then you'll pair up the vehicle to your phone. Once paired, you can receive phone calls, you can make phone calls all using your voice. And then with regards to navigation, you can search, you can set up a home address, a work address, your favorites, if you're just looking for food, fuel, whatever, there's a variety of things you can find. Automotive, dealerships Ford, Ed Learn Ford and save to your favorites. Down below the screen, we have our stereo volume, tuning to the next station, your temperatures, hotter and colder, and it's dual zone. And you also have your heated seat and buttons. So when you turn them on, three lights come on for a high heat down to medium heat, low heat, and then no heat. So this has been your introduction to the 2017 Ford Edge. Hope you'll enjoy your vehicle. Please let me know if you ever have any questions or any concerns. Once again, I'm Jim Brickle from Ed Learn Ford.